If you're looking for a new Toyota pickup truck, you have a decision to make. The Tundra vs Tacoma Tundra and Tacoma history According to CJ Off-Road, the Toyota Tacoma was born in 1995 and replaced the manufacturer's then-truck, the Toyota pickup. 2024 Toyota Tacoma revealed with 326 HP hybrid power, new off-road trim the Ford Ranger rival has a turbocharged hybrid engine and even more off-road prowess. Turbo and hybrid power The most interesting details are under the hood. Toyota offers four different outputs for the Tacoma starting with the base SR model. The entry point is a new turbocharged 2.4-liter .4 four-cylinder that lets out 228 horsepower and 243 pound-feet of torque when paired with the standard 8-speed automatic transmission. Buyers can move up from there to the State Route 5 and get a more powerful version of that same turbocharged engine producing 270 horsepower and 310 pound-feet. Better yet, that's with a 6-speed manual transmission with automatic rev matching, long live the stick. That same upgraded engine with the 8-speed automatic adds more oomph, bringing the output to 278 horsepower and 317 pound-feet. At the top of the range, the Tacoma offers an optional hybrid engine for the first time. Borrowing the iForce Max branding from the bigger Tundra, a 1.9 kWh battery back and 48 HP electric motor join the turbocharged 2.4-liter engine, bringing the total output to a hardy 326 horsepower and 465 pound-feet. That's nearly double the amount offered on the outgoing V6 model and second only in horsepower to the new 405 horse Ranger Raptor, but the Taco still has more torque. Rear wheel drive is still standard on trims like the SR and State Route 5, but now it comes with a limited slip differential. Four wheel drive models add an electronically controlled two speed transfer case with high and low range gearing as well as an upgraded active traction control system with a limited slip diff. Opt for the top of the line limited model with the hybrid I Force Max engine and that comes with full time four wheel drive with a center locking differential. The multi terrain select drive mode function now extends to 4WD high as well as 4WD low with three modes adjustable on the fly, mud, dirt, and sand. Toyota also says the crawl control function, basically cruise control for off-roading, is much quieter than it was last year and comes with five adjustable speeds. And to keep you comfier on the trail, Toyota developed an isodynamic performance seat that uses embedded shock absorbers to help dampen body movement and stabilize the head and neck of the driver. But for overlanding enthusiasts, Toyota introduces a new Trail Hunter trim for 2024. It sheds the TRD Pro's Fox shocks for 2.5-inch forged monotube Old Man Emu shocks instead, designed by Australian-based ARB specifically for long-range off-road travel. There are new steel bumpers, more robust rear recovery points, enhanced rigidity for things like rooftop tents, and the choice of a 5 or 6 foot bed depending on your overlanding needs. With the change to its naming structure, the Tacoma became the manufacturer's mid-sized truck compared to its larger pickup, the Tundra. The Tundra has more power, payload and towing capabilities compared to the Tacoma. At the standard level, the Tundra has a 4.6 Li Force V8 with 310 horsepower and 327 pound-feet of torque. It also has a 6-speed automatic transmission. This engine also has a double overhead cam, a 32-valve head design and variable valve timing. In addition, you can get a 5.7 Li Force V8 engine with 381 and 401 pound-feet, respectively. This engine offers additional horsepower and torque. According to Torque News, when you decide between the Tundra and the Tacoma, it comes down to your preferences and how you plan on using your truck. With the Tacoma, you get a 2.7-liter four-cylinder with 159 horsepower and 180 pound-feet of torque. There's also the popular 3.5-liter V6 engine, which offers 278 horsepower and 265 pound-feet of torque. With V6 models like the TRD Sport, Off-Road, and the Pro, 
you can opt for a six-speed manual transmission. In addition, a six-speed electronically controlled automatic transmission is also an option. Cab size per auto trader, with the 2019 Toyota Tacoma, you can get the access cab or double cab. They both have 42.9 inches in legroom for front seat passengers. The access has 24.6 inches of space for rear seat legroom, and the double has 32.6 inches of space for rear seat legroom. Both models have 39.7 inches of front headroom. The Access has 34.9 inches in rear headroom, and the Double has 38.3 inches of rear seat headroom. The 2019 Tundra offers the same in front headroom with both the Double Cab and Crewmax. You also get a little less than 39 inches in rear seat headroom. The Tundra also has a little less front legroom, 42.5 inches compared to Tacoma's 42.9 inches. In the double cab, you get 34.7 inches of rear seat legroom. With the Crewmax, you get 42.3 inches.